Hi, my name is Angel and today I wanted to do two summer reviews. These are two products that recently came out from Misha and the Face Shop for the summertime and I wanted to do a review on them. And with that said, let me get right to it. The first product that I wanted to mention is the Face Shop Natural Sun Echo Eyes Air Puff. And this recently came out for the summertime and I read one of the reviews from a power blogger and she mentioned this product and said that this is actually a very nice product so I picked it up and wanted to do a review on it this is something that I never used before so you do have to know how to use it the first thing you do is there is a lock button so that it locks up the product so that it is safe because inside it does contain gas and so I really like that they have a safety lock so you turn it into on and you, before you use it, you have to shake it and you have to pump it at least three to four times and then you get the product and you can see that the product is right there and you just have to apply it evenly all over your face I don't know if you can see the visibility but it is it's a sunblock with just a very slight tint. What I really like this about this product is as soon as I apply it, it is icy cold. So it kind of feels like it depuffs your skin. So be and since because I do apply this in the morning, it really feels so good. Especially because it is humid and hot. It feels so good just to have that cold, you know, sensation on your face. And you know, you get to rub it all over and it glides on very evenly. And it feels like a primer. I can definitely see that this does help set your makeup. So I do feel like this works as a sunscreen and as slightly as like a primer helper. And so I have been using this as a sunblock slash primer these days. And I really been enjoying this product. But the downside of it, it is that it does smell like gas. And when you pump it and you apply it to your skin, you can smell the gas and you can smell that the pro you know the product has been contained in gas so if you have sensitive skin i don't really recommend this product and also if you're sensitive to the smell and scent i definitely think that you would not enjoy this product but i don't mind at all i actually don't mind about the smell and i've been enjoying this every day and i also do have this on my face today as well and the second product that i picked up was from Misha. They came out with a new tint recently. It is in a velour flat pen tint. I hope I'm pronouncing the velour part right. <laughs> but I picked this one up in Sweet Cherry. It looks exactly like a pen, kind of like a marker. And it is in a, I don't know if it's focusing, it is in a flat shape. And the reason I picked this up was when I swatched it in the store. Ta-da! It swatched really, really well. But what I was really surprised about was how strong the color absorbed to the skin. So I felt like this would be a very long-lasting product. And inside the store, you know, I tried to erase it with a makeup wipe. And still, the tint will be pretty strong. And... It wouldn't budge that much so when I saw that I thought oh this will be such a nice product to pick up for the summertime and so I did and I thought the price was really really fair it was only six dollar and eighty cents so I was really happy to find this product but to be very honest I haven't been enjoying this product and the first reason is how it applies to my lips it is not easy to apply and second of all, the most important reason I picked this product up was because I thought it would be long lasting and that it would, you know, stain my lips for quite a long while. After applying this product, I had lunch and I came back and I realized some of the products were gone. Like some of the products, you know, I ate away with my food. So when I realized that the tint was not as effective as I thought it would be, it wasn't long lasting. So I was really disappointed. I will continue to use this since you know I purchased it but I would definitely not purchase this again and I didn't enjoy it as much as I thought I would 
you know, when I first picked up this product, the first thing that I thought about was doing this review. So I hope that it helped for anybody that has questions about these products. Thank you guys so much for watching this review, and I hope you guys all have an amazing day. See you guys very soon, and bye!